Heroes of Tomorrow is a partnership event between TechFest and Equinor and it's designed to give young people, our Heroes of Tomorrow, a chance to meet industry professionals, to try opportunities, to, to workshops that use some of the skills, the sort of transferable skills that they have, but maybe have never thought about what they would like to apply those to into the future. So it's a practical opportunity for kids to get hands on, but also to just to focus their minds about all the things that they can do and have the opportunity to ask questions. A day out at school to think about what they do in the classroom and how important it is. And sometimes when the young people ask the question, when am I ever going to use this? They've come along today and they're left in no doubt that everything that they're learning in school is going to set them up for the future, but the opportunity to think, what do I want to do? And all the choices they have. overwhelming response I've got today and, and yesterday when we've welcomed more than 400 students and their teachers is just this energy. They have brought this whole event alive. When we when we sit as of tomorrow planning for the next event, they we, we have their vision in, in mind because they've given it to us. They've told us what they've asked for. They're wanting hands-on opportunities for them to show off what they can do. They're so creative and they're so passionate and they're such natural problem solvers. And so they've brought all of this energy, but they've also inspired us um, to think about what we can do to help produce more events like this for them. But they've made their vision and, and their energy and, and their enthusiasm has, has come in bucket loads from them and also their teachers who've been fantastically supportive of this event and bringing the students, but also they will carry that on following along from today. The teachers have been given resources to take back to school that would help our young people think more and more and more about what they've learned today, but also the opportunities for them in the future. Absolutely. So Heroes of Tomorrow, we actually did our first event on a much, much smaller scale in 2015. We sat with Equinor and they said, what is it that you want to do? And we wanted to keep um, a clear focus over each year that we've, we've done this event, keeping our Heroes of Tomorrow in mind, our young people. But also, as we move to planning for next year, there'll be more opportunities for our young people to showcase what they can do. There'll be more opportunities for industry to talk to young people at the different platforms that we've provided, either through the careers panel, the net careers networking, or some of the hands-on workshops that the kids have done today. So when we put the plans together for next year, it'll hopefully be even bigger. Each year we've grown and grown and we've always, thanks to the support from Equinor, been able to, to meet the requirements of all schools. So anyone who wanted to come to Heroes of Tomorrow has been able to come. And that's why the event is more than doubled from one year to the next. But having this fantastic space here at Robert Gordon University gives us huge potential for growth. And the fact that there's so many organisations like the Society for Petroleum Engineers, Absafe, and the Robert Gordon University for bringing their workshop, the team from Equinor, for assisting us in delivering these. We've also had a, a great game installation manager with our with our partners um, at Risk Tech. We've had the opportunity to put more and more workshops on and grow and grow and grow and grow. And so who knows what to, the, tomorrow's event will hold, but hopefully we'll be able to continue to, to welcome more and more students and to keep giving them the, the event that they that they, they deserve. And, and match their enthusiasm and passion in the, in the events that we deliver.